Hey people, it's Empty Squared here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make my, not mine, but like if you guys want to do it, how to make a logo. I'm going to be making my Xbox and PS3 logo for Empty Squared. Alright, so first I'll start out with the Xbox, and this is for Mac users only, by the way. All you have to do is double click, it opens it up as an image, and then, where is it? Uh, select. You go instant alpha and you just drag make everything around it pink I'm not trying to do that wait now you have just a background of the xbox controller just save it command s save I have it right there. Okay, make sure you know which one's which. So that's that. Let's shut this one off. I'll close it. And then the donut. Same thing with the donut. Uh, yeah. Expand that. Go to. Instant alpha again. Delete. And here. I'm gonna make a C out of this, but I'm gonna make it like someone bit it. I'm gonna try to make it like someone bit it. So delete. It's not really accurate, but Alright, so, so from here, just like that. I need to cut that off. On rugged. It's pretty good. I don't want it to be like too. Per I don't want it to be perfect. So, so like that. MC and then get the number two. This will be the easiest one because all I have to do is this. Delete. Done. Command S. Sort that. Now, next thing you want to do is you want to open up Pages. Blank. It can be the landscape or portrait mode. And you're gonna have the M here. And the C beside it. Make it smaller though. You want the M and the C to be exact same size though. Like so, the M are actually a little bigger than the C. that and then bring that forward and then for the squared all you do is bring it in shrink it all the way and you're done crunch it wait let's go enter, enter, enter. and then if I want I could write on YouTube like that let's see by the way all these pictures are from Google so I just want an arrow PS3 or Xbox controller and then YouTube full size image save image save save that double click that go there. there and 
Done. Now I need to bring that small. Then size eight, sixteen bold, not sixteen. We'll go back to eleven. Bold. Alright, just leave it there. And then the user just put that under there. Okay, now that'll be better. Okay. Okay. So there, MC Squared on YouTube. And you're done with your logo. Now all you do is enter, enter, enter. Then hit Command, Shift, and 4. That's how you take a snapshot. You go up here down to where you think it'll end and then you have your logo MC squared on YouTube and then with the PS3 let me just delete that PS3 you do the same thing but you go there PS3 will be easier I think because there's no rugged lines that command ass save was that PS3 controller? And then Command Shift 4. Now I have a PS3 logo too. So, no, Command C. Or ESC to cancel that. What I'm going to do is, since the PS3 controller is a little wider than the Xbox controller, I'm going to move everything to the side a little more. The YouTube can just stay there. Alright, so command shift four seven down. You now I have my PS3 logo too. No, don't save. Where's the PS3 logo? Now as you see here, I have both logos complete. Xbox logo, PS3 logo. I honestly think that the Xbox logo looks better. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is MC Squared, a how to video done by MC Squared. Alright, peace. See you later.